what's up guys welcome back to my channel i hope you are doing absolutely amazing today as you can see here today's video is going to be a quick showcase of my levi's earlier this year i decided that i wanted to really start buying more quality clothes that would last me years as opposed to buying fast fashion and i also wanted to start shopping more sustainably where possible i know not all brands that i buy are going to be sustainable but at least I want them to be good quality clothes that will last me a long time. Therefore, I wanted to invest in a couple of pair of Levi's and I know that Levi's does have a sustainable play, I think like waterless or something about the way that they create their jeans is definitely sustainable, so that is a plus. And when I bought all of these, they were 40% off. Yes, and Levi's can tend to be expensive, like $100 plus for a pair of jeans sometimes. So I definitely got them for a steal. And I wanted to share the ones that I got and actually kept with you guys because I am in love with some of these pieces. So without further ado, let's just get on into the video. The first style that I got are their rib cage straight jeans. When you research best Levi jeans, these definitely rise to the top. And I watched a bunch of videos and a bunch of reviews on these jeans and everyone absolutely loved them. So I decided to give them a try and I do understand what all the hype is about. I just love the way that these fit on me. So they are extremely high, which is why they're called rib cage. They literally come up to your rib cage. And for me, because I'm short, they really come up to my rib cage. As far as the fit through the leg, I will say it is fairly loose for someone like me who doesn't, I, I don't have no hips. I mean, my hips, they don't lie because they're not talking because they don't exist pretty much. So yeah, I really don't have hips. I don't have thighs. I don't have much meat even like down my leg. So these definitely are a looser pair of jeans on me, even the butt. Like I feel as if for my size, I have a pretty solid but but even still in these jeans it definitely is a little bit looser but i absolutely love just the vibe that these give off they're very relaxed as far as the fly part of the pants it is just all buttons all the way up and these jeans do have a sort of brown Levi's patch at the back as well. These are a size 23 and the length is a 27. And for Levi's, 27 is the perfect length for me. It comes down to my ankles, like right below my ankles so that my ankles aren't showing, um, but they're not dragging on the floor either. And I don't remember the specific wash of these, but I'll definitely put it on the screen and also leave a link in the description box but this is a lighter wash and then i also got these in a darker wash and this is the dark wash i got these in a size 23 and oddly they only came in a length of 29 which is way like way too tall for me so i did have to get these taken in at the bottom by two inches to fit that length of the 27 that's perfect for me um so yeah these are literally the exact same jeans as the other ones the rib cage straight i will say because it is a darker wash i don't know if it's because it's a more natural wash of denim i'm not really sure but these fit way more fitted than the lighter wash do i'm not sure if it's just how they have to manipulate the denim to get that specific wash if it just loosens the material i don't really know the sciences behind how you make denim however i just know that these fit me a lot a lot tighter in the waist it fits a lot more snug and even in my hips it definitely fits a lot more snug there and also in my thighs as well. I really like these jeans. It's just something about the style of these. You see most people nowadays wearing skinny jeans. So these jeans just give a more elevated look to whatever your outfit is. The third pair of denim that I got is these 
sort of distressed jeans and they are in the wedgie straight style so these are still high waist they don't come up as high waist as the rib cage denim does it does come up pretty high on me still though and what i find as far as the fit is different from the rib cage is that these are a lot more fitted through the length of my leg it probably starts to not be fitted on my leg around my knees or right above my knees so these definitely fit me a lot more snug but they are still straight leg as far as the the leg all the way down it's not as wide as the rib cage though they're not boyfriend jeans but they do give off the vibe of boyfriend jeans which is what i really like about these so again as with really all these levi's there are buttons all the way up and the patch on the back. I also got these in a size 23. The length was a 28, so I had to get them taken in one inch to be a length of 27. So those are the pants that I got, and I also wanted to grab some shorts for the summer. So I purchased these shorts. These are the 501. 501, I don't really know what else is the name, but it just says 501. Um, but I've been looking for just some staple everyday denim shorts. So I saw these and I was immediately drawn to them. I really like the unfinished hem on them just because it adds a little zhuzh or pizzazz, you know, to an outfit. And they're also just not too short. They are somewhat short, but they're not as short as the shorts I used to wear because I feel like I'm getting older, I'm getting wiser, I'm kissing 30, and I feel like I should wear grown women's shorts now. So I definitely feel like these are those grown women shorts, at least for me. As far as the wash is concerned, these are a light wash jeans. I don't know, it's just something about the lighter wash that feels a lot more summery to me and per usual when i really like something i get it in multiple colors and washes so i also got the 501 in the white color as well i have not had white shorts in a very long time so i just really needed a pair of staple white shorts literally the exact same style is these right here just in a white wash um, and I really love how the brown patch looks on the white shorts. And I haven't worn these, which is why the tags are still on them. This would actually be cute with the shirt that I'm wearing now. Oh, uh, this might have to be my outfit tomorrow. We'll see, we'll see. So that is a quick run through of my current Levi stash. I just really enjoy how high quality Levi's are. Like none of these pants stretch, they don't give, they, they are tight. Like they are those like old school fitted, good quality thick jeans. Maybe not the shorts. The shorts are probably a, a little less rugged, if that makes any sense. But uh, these pants over here, definitely like they don't give, they don't stretch. You, you just gotta fit in them. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to give it a thumbs up because it literally costs you nothing at all. It is free and it really helps me out. Also, be sure to subscribe if you have not already. Uh, we are almost at 100K. I don't know when this video is gonna go out, so I don't know if we've reached 100K. I've literally filmed videos for the whole month of August. So maybe we've reached 100K, I don't know yet, but if we have not, or even if we have, please subscribe if you are not already, and I will see you guys in my next video. Peace.